Hi everyone, so my name is Maisha Islam and I'm the Executive Director of Full Metal Beavers. As the month of March is coming to an end, I wanted to remind you that women's history is an important part of the world and it will continue to be throughout time. Throughout the years, our organization has continuously served as a symbol of change and we have lived by three simple but very powerful words which are equity, opportunity, and unity. In 2017, our organization had a ratio of one girl to three boys with only one girl in the leadership positions. But this season we have improved and we now have an approximate ratio of one girl to one boy with eight girls on the leadership team. And our goal continues with the next generation of leaders. Hello, my name is Ashley Apolicio and I am the director of the business department. I joined Full Metal Beavers in the year 2019. Um, hi, my name is Richard Paul. I'm the manager of the Outreach Division and I joined the Full Metal Beavers in 2017. Hello, I am Rita Gonzalez, the director of the engineering department and I joined Full Metal Beavers in 2018. Hi, my name is Kelly Moti and I am the manager of the communications division and I've been on the team since 2017. When I joined the team, I expected to learn a lot more about business, especially in finance, since I was really interested in that career path. I also really hoped that the team would help me in leaving my shell more, since I was not really outgoing, and also help me discover what I liked doing. I also expected to make a lot of new friends since I was a freshman and I didn't really know anybody, but the thing that I really looked forward to when joining the team was making a huge contribution or impact in Full Metal Beavers. Before I joined the robotics team, I thought I would only have experience in building a robot or a mechanical division. However, after my first year, my position ranged from helping the team uh, prepare for the competition to my current position, which involves me um, it spread the importance of community service to my fellow members. When I joined FMB, I expected to learn more about mechanical engineering and the entire field of engineering as a whole because at the time I was really trying to figure out what I liked about engineering and the field and what I would be interested in. But more importantly, I really hoped to make friends and to gain self-confidence skills because I've always considered myself a very good speaker, but I was always too afraid of speaking in public and to show off this skill and that I thought that FMB would help me with that. When I first joined the team, I expected to be the one following instructions and mainly learning by engineering as that was what I was passionate about at the time. I also really hoped to know what it felt like to be on team because I never experienced that before. I also hope to make connections throughout the team. Since I was shy, I hope that I can make connections and make friends. I also wanted to find a way out of my shell and I knew that joining the team would give me an opportunity to do so. When I first became a leader, it was extremely difficult for me because this was the first position I ever earned as a leader. My mindset was extremely different. I remembered that I wanted to take it step by step before earning such a huge position. I also remember shaking a lot when I officially became the business director to the point where I couldn't think. To where I am now, I can say that I have learned a lot. In the beginning, I was extremely nervous and afraid I would mess up or even have my position taken away. But I learned that by messing up or by following our own instincts, we're able to learn from our mistakes and even become stronger people. I can say that becoming a leader was extremely worth it. Um, I've been a leader for about three years in this team and each year I've had at least three different leadership positions. When I was first offered my leadership position, I was really scared to take it because I didn't know what it meant to be a leader, let alone what my position required me to do. Um, but regardless of my feelings, I accepted the position because I really wanted to have an impact on the team based on the personal growth that the team implemented on me just after my first year. Um, and I learned that despite all the challenges um, and the mistakes and all the hard work, it really pays off once you know what your team stands for and once you learn that, you learn to grow with your team.
I've been a leader twice in my history with Full Metal Beavers. Last year, I was the manager of the mechanical division. And when I got that role, I was so afraid of messing up or not being good enough to be a leader. But at the same time, I was extremely excited for all the experiences I would gain and all the new things I would learn. And throughout these two years, I really learned that there are a lot of ups and downs to leadership, but as long as you really understand yourself and your team, you guys have a, a very high chance of succeeding. It's just about communication and respect for each other and just overall working together. When I first became a leader in my sophomore year, I was really scared and nervous as I imagined it to be a big leap from being shy and reserved to having to become confident, assertive, and overall more outgoing than I'm used to being. For the past three years of being a leader, a director for two years and a manager for one, it was a roller coaster as I had to overcome many obstacles within myself in order to become a good leader. From being a leader, I learned three lessons. To not be afraid to make changes, to not be afraid to show my true self, and also to not be afraid to mess up. The team has really impacted me. I remember when I first joined the team, I was extremely quiet and shy. The attention I received when I would talk made my face extremely red, but little by little, I started to discover myself more and became extremely confident. My skills in speaking have really improved a lot. The team provided me with many opportunities to speak in front of the school, have my own meetings, and even speak at workshops for FMB members. The team has also impacted me in discovering what I like and what I want to do in the present and in the future. Being a director has also allowed me to become extremely considerate of my collaborators and managers. Becoming open-minded and handling criticism has helped me in improving my leadership and even myself. I really have to thank my managers and directors because they have impacted me enormously. Um, the form of papers really challenges you to be the best version of yourselves because the result of your actions not only impacts you, but it impacts everybody in the team. Um, and personally, the format of viewers really helped me step out of my comfort zone because uh, once, I, once you experience the adrenaline of taking charge of a project that you've never worked on before, um, it motivates you to continue on experiencing things that you've never done before. Being in Full Model Beavers has given me this insane sense of confidence that I've never really felt before in my life. We're really like this big supportive family and when you have so many people there to help you when you're feeling low and to hype you up when you're doing well, it really is amazing for your self-confidence. Being a leader has given me so much endurance and has made me stronger as a person. Being on the team has impacted me a lot as it helped me gain self-confidence and because of the vast amount of support that I received while being on the team, I was able to grow into the person that I am today. I will forever be grateful for the support that I received and the experience of being a leader and also being on the team. So thank you.